Good day everybody, welcome to today's video. This is Jerry from BSK Garage. And today we're gonna to talk about axle seals and why do they leak? Especially if you just put in new ones. There's a couple of really quick explanations that I'm gonna go over, keep this video nice and short to explain to you what the problem could possibly be. First things first, if you keep on replacing the seal and it leaks, perhaps your axle bearing is shot. If your axle bearing is shot, if there's a lot of play in it, and it gives the axle movement to move, like my finger's doing, it's gonna wear that lip down on that seal, and with it moving like that, it's gonna cause it to leak. The second thing is, since we're talking about the seal, let's go over to the axle shaft. So you can see my axle shaft right here, and that's where the seal groove or where the seal rides so over time believe it or not that seal could rub a wear mark into there now of course if you get a groove worn into your axle shaft and it causes it to leak don't be alarmed because you can get a speedy sleeve for that that'll correct that problem hopefully short term at least so we covered talking about the bearing itself being worn causing a leak we also talked about the surface being worn and you can put a speedy sleeve on you also got to look at the possibility that maybe the axle shaft is bent or even the axle housing is bent because this would cause issues and especially cause the seal to leak now it is possible you could have issues with your differential or your carrier bearings which would cause your axle to somewhat vibrate and flow too, which would cause a seal leak as the vibrations transfer down to the end of the axle. Now let's go back over everything again, what your main reasons are probably going to be. If you keep replacing seals, there's a good possibility A, the bearings are shot, or the axle has a groove in it worn from the seal that you're going to need a speedy sleeve put on. Those are going to be the most common issues. Rarely you're going to get into if you have a bad or bent axle shaft. And obviously if you damaged it somewhere just prior, that would probably be a telltale sign. But focus on the things I just mentioned. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you have any questions or comments, post them below. See you guys in the next one.